good morning students in the previous class i had explained you about axioms and postulates now we'll see about lines and angles the when two ray, uh, rays meet at a point an angle is formed so if uh, oa and ob oa and ob are the two rays meeting at o then here we are getting aob is the angle formed so here oa and ob are called as the arms of the angle or sides of the angles and o is called the vertex of the angle now based on this angle the, that is the angle formed here between the two rays we have different types of angles the first type of angle is straight angle if the if two rays form an angle of 180 degree that is if it is a straight line then you are calling it as a straight angle the next type of angle is acute angle if the angle between the rays is less than 90 degree that is if it is less than 90 degree then it is called as acute angle then we have the right angle if the angle between the two rays is exactly 90 degree then you are calling it as a right angle next is the obtuse angle if the angle between the two rays is more than 90 and less than 180 degree then you are calling it as an obtuse angle reflex angles are those which measure more than 360, 180 degree and less than 360 degree such an angle is called as reflex angle the next type of angle is complete angle if the angle formed by two rays is completely equal to 360 degree that is it is forming a complete circle such an angle is called as complete angle we have other types of angles also that is supplementary angle here supplementary angle is when you take a right angle triangle and divide it into two angles that is the sum of the two angles should be equal to 90 degree such an angle is called as supplementary angle here we have ABC this is a right angle triangle right angle uh, right angle I am dividing drawing a ray BD so here I am getting two angles ABD and DBC so these two angles when I add up I will be getting 90 degree such angles are called as supplementary angles same way we have complementary angles that is the sum of two angles should be equal to 180 degree here ABD is a straight line and uh, BD, BC is the ray which is drawn on a, a, B, a, D. So, when I add A, B, C and C, B, D, it should be equal to 180 degree. Such angles are called as complementary angles. The next type of angles are adjacent angles. That is, if two angles, they have a common side and a common vertex. For example, I have X, Y, P, angle X, Y, P, in which Y, Z is the common arm between X, Y, Z and Z, Y, P and uh, y is the common vertex so these two angles x y z and z y p are called as the adjacent angles the last type of angle is vertically opposite angle if i take two rays a a b two line segments a b and c d and they are meeting at a point o here i am getting four angles a o d d o b b o c and c o a four angles are got in these four angles angle aod and cob are vertically opposite in the same way aoc and dob are vertically opposite such angles are called as and these angles are equal they are called as vertically opposite angles okay hope you have understood all this same definitions you write three three times and practice the types of angles thank you students